Today on Run Adventurer, we're in the Peak District in Derbyshire, near Bakewell. Starting from over Haddon, we're having a run up beside the River Lathkill and then picking up a section of the Limestone Way. Morning adventurers, welcome back. It's the uh, 29th of December 2023. I'm off this week for, uh, from work so I'm taking advantage and filming as much as possible. I think this might well be the fourth time I've filmed. And so, do, so I've taken advantage of being off to travel a little bit further. So today I've travelled across into Derbyshire. We're near Bakewell at Overhaddon. And we're at uh, Lathkill Dale. So the river Lathkill runs through here. The, it's very pretty, I'm told. Never been. Uh, with caves and waterfalls and things like that. So I thought we'd just come and have an explore. I hope you'll come along today with me and uh, share the adventure. Come on, let's go and see what it's like. So I'm starting from the Pay and Display car park at Overhaddon. I will point out somewhere you could park for free later in the video. Just note the machine, you can either pay with coin or using the app. Unfortunately, the machine wasn't accepting coins and I didn't have any phone signal here in the car park. However, I climbed up the hill a little way and then I was able to get a phone signal and pay with the app. Right, let's head down the hill down to the river Lathkill. And here's the river, we'll come back over that bridge. I'm not sure the pictures really show just how clear the water was. It really was crystal clear. The Lathkill is a winterborne stream which dries up in sections over the summer but in heavy rain, like now in the winter, water rises from sinkholes near Overhatton and uh, then runs in deep pools. As you'll see, uh, the path was slightly underwater. I brought Ruth with me, she's having a short walk and doing a bit of photography while I'm on the run. Lathkill Dale is one of the finest limestone valleys in the Peak District. Steep sided with fast flowing water, mossy rocks and beautiful woodland. made of limestone the valley is full of caves and there is a cave system that cavers do explore though I believe they only explore it in the summer when that river starts to dry up.
haven't traveled far, but the river has changed character from the quieter, slower moving river to this raging torrent. And it's about to get a lot deeper. And so here, the river has just swamped the path. My advice, if you come at this time of year and it's flooded like this, is wear shorts and just wade through it. Uh, I started by climbing up the sides like the other walkers, but very quickly decided, sod it, and just headed straight through it. I'm going to just go to that path, you know. I reckon, I reckon a little bit of water can't, can't do you any harm. Oh, it's lovely and warm. And we're through. Yeah, this is the way to go. Just wade through it. And so when I reached the next stretch of water, I didn't hesitate and just went straight through it. This bit really was quite deep. so I don't splash you. <laughs> Once you're wet, you're wet. Yeah. <laughs> it's cool though, is it? Uh, actually, it's not too bad. Huh? No, it's, it's fine. It's warm, isn't it? Once you get out yeah. of water, it's like... Yeah. Bad. I don't know if that's <laughs> adpermia or not, right? Yeah, I've, I've had that before. I don't want it to get <laughs> There are a whole series of these weirs. They're really pretty. Right. The dog. <laughs> hey, Pooch. All right. Hello. It's a nice bit of swimming ahead. Yeah, so you either you either got to go up the side or be prepared to wade to about that really? depth. You went through, didn't you? I just went through. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Once you're wet, you're wet. Yeah, but you look like yeah, 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 yeah. I might do the side. <laughs>
we've reached the Sheepwash Bridge and we're going to cross over and climb out of the valley and boy is it a climb. We're going to pick up a section of the Limestone Way. When the path forks, turn left and then climb the steps up out of the valley. In my defence, I did have heart surgery five weeks ago, so... Five weeks ago? Yeah. You'll be glad of a breather at this point. Uh, so it's just as well. The view down into Lathkill Dale is pretty stunning.
So we're heading through Lowmore Wood now and then through to Back Lane where we take a left down the hill. We're not too far from Yule Grieve and then taking the path on the left back to our starting point. As promised, here's that alternative parking. As always, details of today's route, including a map and GPX file, and details of the parking are available on my website.
talk about your names, Hamish. Well, that was an adventure, wasn't it? I mean, it wasn't just the fact that uh, we had to wade through waist deep water. Uh, the path was technical, so it wasn't super fast. If you want to run it any faster, go in the summer. But yeah, I just love that. The best bit is beside the river, I think. But. Uh, yeah, I got into a proper transcendental state running down once uh, down off the top on the far side. Oh, yeah. Come and give it a visit, it's beautiful here. Right, I've got a, I'm just gonna walk up the hill back to the car. So I stopped the clock at 5.6 miles. It's a little under six miles, maybe. If you run all the way up the hill, and if you run all the way up that big hill at mile two and a half, you are my hero. Right, take care folks. See you all next time.